Hey, Michael Church, Crawl Space Ninja, and I'm here with Austin from ShipShape. How you doing, Austin? Doing good, man. All right. Glad to be here. Well, for those of you that have never heard of ShipShape, uh, that's what this video is all about. We're going to share with you why has Crawl Space Ninja partnered with ShipShape, what is it that their technology is capable of doing, and why, why should you as a homeowner or a contractor even uh, consider using this product? So stay tuned. So Austin, I learned about ShipShape from uh, Brock at April Air when I went out to Wisconsin to do some uh, plant tours with them and to learn more about their product. And they were really bragging on what you all are doing and all that and how ShipShape and April Air dehumidifiers and sump pumps and different things like that work together. So share with, uh, with our viewers, what is ShipShape? And why do people like us, crawl space, encapsulation, basement waterproofers, recommend this product? Yeah, absolutely. So basically, ShipShape has created a way to save homeowners time, money, and energy at their home and educate them on the importance of home maintenance. And how we do that is we've created a check engine light for your home that's going to send you real-time alerts and monitor those, those major appliances. So uh, a real great way that I like to explain it is you know, if you're going to get that crawl space encapsulated and have a commercial dehumidifier and a commercial sump pump in that area, you're going to want to know that stuff's working. And that's how that's where ShipShape comes into the picture is we monitor those appliances for you and then send you real time alerts straight to your phone. So, you know, if it's working, you know, if it's not. So that way you can be proactive rather than reactive. One of the concerns I had when I was approached uh, about your technology was, OK, it's in the crawl space. Can Wi-Fi reach down there? Because quite honestly, it, we have come across issues where Wi-Fi thermostats and all these different things were not able to make its way to the crawl space, especially if you've got a two-story house, your router's upstairs. Right. You know, so what does ShipShape have in the box that helps to make sure, first of all, is it Wi-Fi? And what does it have in the box to communicate with those appliances in that part of the house that nobody ever goes to? How does it do that? So it's a great question. Basically, we use a gateway that connects into the back of your router. We don't need your Wi-Fi password. It just uses different frequencies to connect. And then we also have a range extender that increases the signal between that gateway and the appliances being monitored. One of the things I found cool about uh, ShipShape was number one, it comes with these little plugs yeah. that plug into outlets because I've got ShipShape in my attic, I've got it in my garage, and my, my uh, router is on the second floor. And the nice thing about it is that in the box, it comes with these little, uh, what you call range extenders. They actually have night lights built into them, yeah, they do. which is kind of nice. So I got one in the hallway and I got a little night light in the hallway and, and all that. So, and then that way, uh, I don't know what frequency or whatever it's using, but it, it causes the signal from where it's located, plugged into the back of the router to be able to reach all the way up to my attic and out to my garage. So unlike other technologies that are Wi-Fi based, this one is more reliable, more dependable from what I could tell. Would yeah, you, absolutely. Would you agree with that? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And if you have a bigger house, five, 6,000 square foot house and your, your router's in the top level and you know obviously your pump's in the crawl space or basement, you can just add a couple more range extenders and it's just gonna increase that signal and they, they boost off of each other. Yeah, so, yeah. Uh, it's, it's really reliable and uh, I, I highly recommend it to, Everybody that has a sump pump in a crawl space or a dehumidifier. Now that could be me being a little biased because yeah, I, I work here. I think he gets paid to say that. Just yeah. Saying that, so. But uh, no, I believe in the product and I believe in what we're building here. Yeah, I do too. I, I, I honestly, you, you uh, came out to my personal home and installed this technology for us and showed us how it worked and, and, and got our appliances hooked up to it. Share with us a little bit beyond the, the dehumidifier and the sump pump, you can put your major appliance information in the ShipShape app. Correct. And all that data is right there. And, and when you get done explaining that, also tell us about monitoring and, and how the app works, if you don't mind. Yeah, absolutely. So other than you know the sump pump and dehumidifier, we can put sensors in your attic to monitor the humidity levels and temperature levels. Uh, because you know your temperature could be 150 degrees and 90% of the time homeowners don't go into those areas of the home because of the non-sexy areas. They're the out of sight, out of mind areas. So having that stuff monitored and being able to tell what the readings are up there can honestly save you a lot of money if you decided to get an attic installation or if you're in a good uh, spot to save money on energy efficiency. 
How the uh, sump pump and dehumidifiers actually monitor is we monitor the kilowatt hours so we can see if the pump's running too hard or not hard enough. We can tell if the float switch is stuck and then we monitor the runtime as well. So if we see that the pump's been running for 24 hours straight, we know that there's an issue. That pump is in risk of burning out or you know maybe they just have a river under their house, uh, but likely the float switch has gotten stuck. So we can see that and we can cut that pump off right there from the app or our dashboard and drop that float switch and cut it back on to see if it's running properly. Um, and then with the dehumidifier, you know, same thing. We monitor the kilowatt hours so we can see if it's if it's running too hard or not hard enough. Right. Um, we can see the humidity levels, and then we can also see the runtime. So if we see that the dehumidifier has been running for 48 hours straight, the humidity level is at 65, but the set point's at 55, we know that there's an issue. Right. Either that dehumidifier is you know undersized, it's not working hard enough to you know humidify the area. Right. Um, but there's several different ways we can tell just through those readings um, what an issue is. And again, you're going to get those real-time alerts right there to your phone so you know exactly what's going on. And I like to say being proactive rather than reactive. Well, and that's that's really why Crawl Space Ninja decided to team up with ShipShape is, is because of the device's ability to monitor humidity. So if we encapsulate a crawl space and we've got this technology installed in there, the dehumidifier could have been working great for a year, right? right? And then all of a sudden you start to see it not working as well. Well, that may be a sign that it needs to be maintenance. It may need the filter changed or may need the condensate pump addressed or whatever. So it's, it's just a great way to monitor those products and technologies that's not top of mind all the time, right? If your refrigerator goes out, you know it goes out because you use it multiple times a day right you know if your dehumidifier is in your crawl space how do you know what's going on with that thing because you don't go in your crawl space nobody does yeah so it's just a great way to be top of mind about those appliances that's what we like about this product so anyway and the app is amazing and one last thing i want you to tell us is it's almost like uh having a uh an alarm system right you all have, I'm, I'm the homeowner, I've got access to the app, I can see what it's doing, but let's say I'm not paying attention, I got my alerts off or something like that. Don't they get like free monitoring the first year Correct. Uh, with your team? Tell us a little bit about that and how that works. Yeah, absolutely. So for the first year of having ShipShape, you get a complimentary year that we monitor it for you for free, but there's no obligation to pay for a subscription or membership you're still gonna get those alerts. You're still gonna get the push notifications and email, but you're just not gonna get the, the phone call. Right. So, you know, if you're on vacation, you have the notifications off, you, you're not checking the email like some people do. That's why we like to give it to some homeowners, especially with older homeowners that don't have a smartphone or don't wanna have the app on their phone. They're like, can someone just do this for me? Yeah. And so we provide that as well. And then we have a home assistant team. They do a very excellent job. They're just a click away. So if you ever need any help or questions about if this can save you money on your insurance, just an example, just one click away, they'll answer and they'll help you out. Wow. So there's a possibility ShipShape could save money on homeowner's insurance. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, most homeowners are eligible to save money on their homeowner's insurance by having leak detection or a water shutoff valve. It just depends on the area and then, of course, your carrier. But just to make it real simple, if, if you do want to know if you're eligible, you just go in the app and we have a chat bot that's in the app and you can just message the chat bot to see if you're eligible and we can help you out. Wow. So it might be worth it just to do that. That's fantastic. Absolutely. Well, well, Austin, I appreciate you sharing all this. It was a, a lot of great information about the ShipShape product and what it does. And uh, we appreciate you all watching. And like I said, we're going to have these products available on our DIY store as well as Crawl Space Ninja is gonna be able to uh, install these products for you if it's something that you're uh, interested in. So make sure you check our services page to see if we got a Crawl Space Ninja near you. And I'm Michael Church with Crawl Space Ninja. We hope you make it a happy and blessed day and we'll see you later.